Welcome everybody to, I guess, the announcement. I think this is like the first time I've seen this many people on the Hermitcraft <laughs> server in front of me, and I'm, I'm pretty, I'm pretty pleased to see so many mustaches in the in the audience today. <laughs> as, uh, as bodes well. Right, we've actually got quite a lot of uh, votes to get through, so I reckon we should crack on. Uh, first of all, we're going to announce who the winner is for dog catcher on the Hermitcraft server. So I think what we're going to do is I'll read out. And then if someone who is near the candidate, if they can put in the uh, concrete powder, then we can get like live results. All right. So uh, the first vote is for Joe Hills. The next one is Joe Hills. Nice. Yeah, go Joe. Yeah, Shocker. Yeah. Right. The next one is Joe Hills. Fantastic. The next, Joe of the Hills is, is another one. So four four votes for Joe. Uh, Joe Hills, that's five votes. <laughs> Joe, six. <laughs> Daffy Duck. Who voted Wait. for Daffy Duck? <laughs> um, <laughs> yeah. yeah. Uh, someone someone's voted for stress, so we might want to pop one on stress's thing somehow. I mean, she wasn't. Okay, whatever. Uh, there's another Joe. Um, okay. Joe Hills. Uh, Joe Hills. Joe Hills. Joe Hills, Joe Hills, Joe Hills, and Joe. All right. Wow. That... Dude, oh, man, like... victory, Joe. Good job, man. <laughs> oh, <laughs> nice, Joe. Yay! Congrats, Joe. Joe. Good job, Joe. Thank you, Thank you, you all made it to dog for catcher. trusting me to clear up this mess that I had nothing to do with. I will <laughs> endeavor to get these dogs safely at the dog sanctuary as soon as possible. Thank, thank you, Joe. All wow, right, what Joe. a guy. Congrats. Let's, uh, congrats. Hello. congrats. I have a quick question. Did I miss the Thanos um, cosplay contest earlier? Or is it just... <laughs> <laughs> Scar, Scar, that's not a good idea. Don't make fun of him, okay? Come on, All right, let's let's go. So, right, uh, ready next to your your polling candidate. The first vote is for stress. Oop. The next one is for false. Oh yeah. Good times with Scar. Yay! Woo. Another woop, woop. another one for Scar. <laughs> oh, another yes. one. Another one for false. Uh -huh. Another Beautiful. for stress. Another for scar. Yes. Scar. <laughs> Another yes. for scar. Oh man. That's three now. Stress. Uh oh. Another oh. for scar. I'm shaking. Yes. Oh man. Oh, man. oh man. Another. Another for false. Uh huh. Another for stress. Oh. Another two for scar. Oh wow. Boom, two. Boom. Two. Two for oh man! Oh. And another for stress, another for false, and then there's like four more scars. Wow. Oh, oh. Like, oh. <laughs> oh. scar! Uh, yeah. what? You are the ah. mayor, inaugural mayor of Hermitcraft. Congratulations, yes. man! Wow, Wait, that was, come I was out. like, I'm out of here. Peace <laughs> out. <laughs> I don't know if I'm going to be a good mayor or not. <laughs> and no one actually win. <laughs> what the heck? Congratulations, Congratulations man. Hey, hold on. Congrats, dude. Like a baby <laughs> practice or something. He's good. He's back. Yeah, no, I, I'm aware of that, Grant. And we'll, we'll be having talk. We'll be having talks later. <laughs> Man, okay. you hired him for that and everything. Sheesh. <laughs> Zero. There's people, wearing, oh, people wearing. People wearing mustaches and the and the shirts. Maybe it's true. They, they didn't. They didn't. This was just a okay. marketing power play. That's all it was. I'm so glad to take that mustache off. Oh, you. <laughs> 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 He, I had it there just can. in case, wow, just should... in hopes, just in hopes that it would that I may may make the may make the cut. Well, I'm a little nervous, a little shaky. Um, all right, I'll be a good mayor, guys. Um, you can count on not seeing any more of this mycelium. No more. The wrong way. Scar, I, I have a request <laughs> as your Scar. first act of mayor. Can we please take these signs down? <laughs> Um, yeah, all but mine. <laughs> all but yours? <laughs> uh -oh. No, no, get rid of them. Get rid of them. Oh, Start tearing God. them down. <laughs> get rid of all the signs. All right, first official order. Let's do it. First official order, remove the signs. Eat. Except on Doc's building, because they look hilarious. <laughs> 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 it looks like an abandoned building. <laughs> Congratulations, Scar. I think it's time for you to, to sit on the throne. Take, <gasps> take, up, take up the diamond throne. It's all yours. Yeah. Can I, can I just have one me. second alone just to lick the diamonds? Just one second. All right, everyone turn around. Everybody look away. <laughs> look away. Everyone turn around. Just for a sec. Ah, they're all mine. Oh, boy. Yeah. No, I changed my vote. Yeah. yeah. No, I just, just, yeah. Okay, I'm good. I'm good. I got yeah. it outside of okay. my system. 
I licked the diamonds. We're all good. Get out of your system. That did, that makes it sound so much worse than it actually is. <laughs> the diamonds actually look Take your wet seat. now. Okay. This Thank is where you. I sit. Okay. That's where you sit. Is he your My jester? chief of staff. <laughs> okay. Well, I guess I'm the mayor. Now what? Speech. Speech. Um, hi. I'm the mayor. Um, I'm going to make the shopping district really great looking. Okay, I'm done with my speech. Thank you. I'm embarrassed. Oh. Everyone's staring at me. <laughs> like, what? Hey, everybody, welcome back to a brand new episode on the Harmacraft Season 7 server. I hope you guys are all having a great day. I suppose I could probably take the mumbo stuff off now that the mayor stuff is finally done. You guys will know who the mayor is very soon. Don't you worry. But before we get into today's video, let's go ahead and hop into the question of the day with 161.16. You guys roasted me in the comments of that last video. Oh, my God. <laughs> with 1.16 being out for a few days now, what? What are some of your favorite aspects of the update? Let me know. Me personally, I love those bastions. Those things are amazing. We got a lot to do today, but before we get into that, I wanted to show you guys some of the upgrades that I made to the Enderman farm, because now that this thing is super relevant again, I wanted to make sure people had a better experience coming over here. So first and foremost, I completely removed most of the building, but the, the most important thing that we did was I just updated the mechanism that holds the Enderman and i made it really really simple lever enderman land you can kill them just like this we have a beacon provided by cub um so kill them get the ender pearls get whatever you need flip the lever they fall down that is so much simpler. So I also removed all of the mechanisms for uh, the automated enderpearl storage. There are tons of enderpearls here if people need them. And uh, it's weird that people put those in there, although all they had to do, maybe it was an inventory thing. But uh, the first thing that we're actually gonna be doing today is getting that netherite, baby. We gotta get geared up, guys. So I have prepared a bit here. We are gonna go to the uh, nether. Now, if we're using TNT in the nether, I have to go about 2,000 blocks out. We kind of have a Gentlemen's role in the server. So I brought a bunch of TNT, a bunch of potions, some golden apples, and we are going to go get that ancient debris and make ourselves some epic netherite gear today. So let's do that now. All right, guys. So I am about uh, 2,500 blocks away. Now, our location is uh, 2,500 pretty much. So I'm going to go to like 2,300, 2,200. I want to mine about 300 blocks uh, straightforward because I want to set up my first type of. Uh, Oh, that's a gravel. I hope that okay. I was, I was really hoping that that wouldn't keep going. <laughs> my game plan for my first technique with mining, because whenever we did this in our Let's Play world, I just mined, and I'm going to be using TNT. Funny enough, I've already found one. But so my game plan here is to mine about 300 blocks forward, and then place TNT every couple of blocks. And so I chose this biome. I think it's Nether Waste, Soul Sand Valley. Okay, well that's fine. As long as it's not Basalt Delta, it should be fine. I'm on level 15 because um, that's sort of the middle area. And on top of that, that's what chat on Twitch said. So, chat, yeah, tw I don't, chat on Twitch said, sorry. Okay, well, I've got uh, fire resistance here. So, I'm going to go ahead and get this dug out uh, about another 200 blocks, I think, and then place the TNT down. And then we're going to go kaboomies, guys. I like the kaboomies. It's going to be fun. We're not using beds, though, because beds would suck. So, anyways, I'll be back. Oh, is it going to keep going? No, it didn't keep going. I have utterly failed to make this go all the way down the line. Next time, I might just place an entire full stack in a row because obviously I am not doing good right now. To be fair, though, I have had problems with this in the past, so don't don't flame me. I promise I'm trying my... Oh, oh, okay. Okay, well, it looks kind of good now. I think we're doing better. I placed those a little bit closer together. All right, all right. So we've got one piece there. There's another piece back there. Is there any more down here? Um, I'm gonna try to remove the lava too, cause you never know. Um, there's some gold. I don't see any down this way though. All right, so let me, let's get the rest of this line to um, TNT out of here. What? Game, what are you doing? That was incredibly weird. I don't think I've ever seen that actually happen before. Really, really weird. Okay. I don't know how much could be left. Oh, there's lava there. Dude, utter failure. Utter failure. My goodness. Oh, that's not good. That one's not going to work either. 
I'm so bad at this. Okay, guys, I'm going to go ahead and accept this L, and I'm going to come back once I have most of the lava removed, because I just want to see... I'm not going to remove the lava for every single chain. I just want to see what's underneath, uh, so, you know, if we need to remove the rest of it or not. All right, so I am in the process of collecting this ancient debris from underneath of where I found the lava. So I, I think I've only found one debris under lava, actually, which was this one. So it's I don't think we're really going to need to remove any um oh that's not good i don't have any potions on me <laughs> gotta be a little bit careful there so from mining the line and finding the debris down the line there uh so far we're up to seven so let's see where we end at here uh so there's seven and uh we could probably just kind of coast back a little bit i kind of want to walk though just to be sure that i don't miss any huh okay i mean this seems probably like one of the easier ways to do it i don't think uh wasting time building a grid tnt or anything like that is really going to be any more helpful than just doing a line straight line uh, i don't see any more here i know that there was more down the line but um lots of gravel i guess it also kind of depends on the biome that you're in as well all right well maybe we didn't get as many as i thought we did but this thing is pretty long again it's like 300 blocks long so um i'm probably gonna miss some too and you guys are most likely gonna roast me for it so i know there was some coming up down here i don't see any more there oh there's uh piglins down here let me go ahead and heal all right i still am not really seeing a lot wow i really thought that i was gonna get more that's it that's insane die die so don't see any there wow okay so there's one coming up up here <laughs> wow we got one guys go team we're doing good here people we're doing good we're making them we're making moves <laughs> all right so that's eight uh and i know there's probably one or two more so there's two up there maybe three i know that i think a max is four in one vein Okay, guys, so I'm back at the base. I've been working on sorting. I've got quite a bit done. Um, we are done with the first two rows, uh, but I'm running into this issue. So I have stone in this chest up here, right? This stone is actually running through the system and not hitting this bottom chest. I think I'm gonna have to ask Tango what's wrong because I literally have no clue. Anywho, we just got back from the nether. We got quite a bit of ancient debris. So I've turned this into the netherite scrap and we are gonna go ahead and turn our uh, diamond armor that we had into the good stuff but i need to look through this absolute mess of an inventory i've been working on organizing it's just i had so much stuff that it's gonna take a little bit of time uh before i can get it all together man i love that crying obsidian of texture that texture is probably i would say probably my favorite new texture in the game i'm looking for wood by the way in this absolute garbage mess of <laughs> it's so bad oh my god i can't even find wood okay i'm sure i probably have another piece of wood around here somewhere there we go all right so let's make a smithing table so we need to do that and then smithing table there we go put that right there now make netherite so it's one piece of netherite per armor so we need three for the uh our actual armor and then we need uh, let's see one two three four five so we need I think we need eight in total there we go so there's eight in total let me grab the rest of my tools all right and so first things first take that off so that's not the helmet that I want to use let's get that out of the way so I do not use that one so this is my good helmet put that right there so we have that is an amazing amazing one 
There we go. Make sure these all have mending and everything. Okay. Best boots ever. God, I, I can't exp I can't I can't stress this enough, guys. That looks so awesome. Can't stress this enough. Feather falling is by far the best enchantment in the game. Do not argue. <laughs> okay. All right. Fortune. So touch. All right. We are completely nether righted out now. That is awesome. Okay. Major, major upgrade today in our tools and armor. Okay, so I have done a lot with another stuff in the first two episodes of it being out. I'm going to actually work on the base some today. So I have been thinking about some things that I want to do around the base, by the way. Just looking completely snazzy over here. And um, I have this idea, right? I want to add another layer to the base. And before I can finish the outside walls, I want to put this layer in. So the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to make a circle on the ground down here to kind of decide where I want this circle to sit up top. We're going to have four pillars going up, and these are going to be elevators going up and down. And we're going to have villagers and villager trading and stuff up in the next layer. So we're not going to do the villager trading today, but I'm going to get that layer built today. Plus, we're also going to be finishing up the uh i'm just bouncing all around look at me go plus we're going to be finishing up the underside today well maybe not the entire underside but i'm going to get these other pillars built i've got to make sure that i have enough that's a wall i've got to get the other blocks built and then i'm going to make a central pillar eventually but i want to make sure that i kind of make sure that i want to put it in there so uh enjoy the time lapses guys because uh we do have replay mod for the new versions so before we get into the time lapse let's go ahead and talk about what i've already done so you see a gigantic circle this circle is 65 total blocks and i decided to go really big on this one so this is going to be like our villager trading area we're going to have a bunch of villagers with different books and on top of that we'll have a central storage section up there for everything that we need to trade whether it's emeralds or you know crops you know we're gonna have all those automated farms so we need a place to store all that outside of this so I think this is gonna work pretty well now let's go ahead and figure out how we're gonna do the tunnels up to that because we're gonna have four pillars so these are the center blocks right here uh this is the center technically speaking so let's come in a few blocks there's like three four i'm thinking about right there so these are going to be made out of prismarine it's right here so this will be made out of prismarine and glass just going to mark that really fast that's kind of far in though let's go there instead all right so i think i'm going to use the prismarine bricks because i do want to start switching up the textures a little bit so prismarine brick there and then glass i think i kind of want this to be very visible so one two three so that's that's still pretty close to um to that the storage there i've changed this circle a couple times um i don't really like the way that that circle looks you know what it's not bad let me let's fly away real fast hold on let me there's a set of chests over here somewhere that has all of my rockets in it. I think it's one of these. There we go. So let's just see what this looks like from kind of a, a different perspective. You know what, though? That's not bad. No, I don't think that's bad at all. So we'll do four of those. So now we need to figure out how tall we're going to make this. Um, so what we'll have in here is this will just be tunnels, right? So we'll like walk into the center and uh, yeah, we'll go from there so hmm interesting how tall do we make this so let's start with 20 blocks and see how tall that looks hopefully it's not super tall looking but at the same time it gives a good proportion because you got to think that once we get up here i'm probably going to do another three blocks for the end stone and then we'll do some glass on top of that so that's that's pretty good height, actually. I like that a lot, actually. Okay, okay. So we're definitely, definitely getting there. I may end up tweaking this a little bit more. Not a huge fan of the way that it looks right now. Um, hmm. We could pull something a little bit different and go to the inside. That would be, we could have a tunnel up and a tunnel down on each side. 
Hmm, that would be that would definitely be different. I would say that hold on. Let me remove the rest of this glass real fast I may end up building two different ones and just letting you guys decide on which I would do if I do this It makes my life a little bit easier because then I can just do the t the pillars up and um, Like the one tunnel inside will be the the up and down. So Hmm, I don't know. All right. I'm gonna get building. So enjoy these time lapses guys All right, so the first part of the ring is finished. So the only thing that really sucks is that I lost the shocker box. It had like a ton of stuff in it. I'm not sure what happened to it, but it's gone. There's like 500 of them down there. So um, let's talk. I like the ring's thickness and all the glass is looking good. Now, remember, we don't have OptiFine right now. So this is going to look a little bad until we have that. But the game plan is to actually do this two more times on top of each other. So we kind of have a little bit of a fog effect once we have all three layers finished. Now, I don't know. Uh, you know what? I'll leave it up to you guys whether or not we should do more layers. I like the way that it's looking right now. I think it looks really good. It's definitely starting to come together um so we'll have maybe a type of a dome up here and then we gotta find a way to do the outside portion because 
you know, it, I just gotta kind of make it more cohesive. Uh, another thing that I'm a little weary on is how close these are to the edge. Maybe one or two more blocks would be very good. I might consider changing that as well. Um, but yeah, we, we got a lot to do. We it's an, it's staggering how much material it actually takes to build something this big. I pretty much ran through two double chests full of uh, of our glass and yeah, there's a lot there. So uh, we're definitely gonna have to do some grindy streams coming up soon with glass and all that good stuff. So, but if you guys enjoyed today's video, I hope you all have a great day. I'm not, I, I, every time guys, muscle memory. I hope you liked the video. No, don't do that. If you enjoy the video, sure, go ahead. But I don't want you to do it just because I say so. Anyways, have a great day, everybody. Thank you all for watching. This is Iron Jevin. Peace out.